Yeah. What was your name again? Vincent. Dotson. Vincent. What's your last name? Dotson. Dotson. Okay, uh, Vincent, so you've been homeless in Hawaii before? Uh, this is my first time uh, 14 years here homeless. Okay, so you were homeless for 14 years? or? I've been here 14 years homeless. Oh yeah? What can you tell me about it? It's rough? Uh, yeah, it's, it's really terrible. Yeah? Um, Especially when it rains? Yeah, that can be a problem. Yeah. Not having a blanket when it's cold. Yeah. Um, and too, too when it's too hot and stuff. Yeah. Um, I think the best thing is uh, transition employment programs. Yeah. And transition lodging programs. Yeah. Um, That's where they should invest in, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. because. Um, uh, that's probably the best thing to keep people busy doing something honest. Yeah. So they can keep their productive, their, sharp, uh, sanity. You yeah. Know. And they feel better about themselves too. Yeah. Because that's a part of sanity. Yeah. Mental health. Yeah. Earning money, buying the things you need to yeah. live. And uh, uh, so there. I, I thought of all kinds of ideas. I want to, like, write a little book or something. You know? Yeah. Um, is there any way anybody can contact you online or uh, email or anything? Or, I have or a phone. Uh, I smashed Facebook? it for oh, yeah. reasons I don't know why. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm yeah. just mentally ill. Yeah. Um, so I did my best to use that and email and stuff. Uh -huh. But it just didn't work out? Well... It had a few tro a little problems, and then the battery had trouble, and then yeah. I smashed it for no apparent yeah, reason. Yeah, you got a whole paragraph on your side, man. Yeah. Oh, you just realized it. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, uh, sometimes people get um, uh, the uh, misconceptions about homeless people, right? Like, um, they'll think that you're just one way or you're not. Like, I've talked to you a couple times. You've always been real nice and uh, polite and everything, you know. But um, people, they get the wrong idea. They'll say, like, uh, homeless people, they give them a bad rap sometimes, right? I hope not. I hope people talk to people face-to-face, -face, look them in the eyes, and, yeah. and judge people case by case. Uh, by their behavior, right? Not, like, uh, just how they and, look. And what they see when they talk to them. Yeah. How they act and... Uh, how they present themselves. Uh, well, I mean, there, there's more to it than presentation, but... There's introspection, you know. Yeah. Looking deeper than appearances. True. Um, if you could change one thing about your life in the past, what would you change? Uh, I, I would say um, my sign talks about something that should be different. Yeah. Um, I went to confirmation classes in the Catholic Church twice, and they didn't really emphasize in any real kind of way fasting uh -huh. they, had, they had one night where nobody ate but uh, they didn't talk about it so it was kind yeah. of half-hearted oh yeah they so didn't, they didn't expand on it verbally you know so are you a religious person or? I was raised Catholic uh -huh. and I was married in the Baptist Church I'm waiting for my wife a total of about 20 years 15 years continuously celibate okay and uh, so I wish that they, like my sign says, I wish that they confirm in writing what people really need to know to be all right with God, including if ever they'd have to fast. Mm -hmm. You know, it should be in writing. They copy a list down, and then on the back, put into their own words what it means, and they're interviewed, and they talk about what they wrote on the back. Yeah. That should be what confirmation is. It should confirm something. They shouldn't just give people a certificate for showing up for... Uh, various exercises, you know, it's like kind of like a uh, social mental health kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, which was really good, but we need them to confirm that we know what we need to know to be all right with God. Yeah. Because I I feel like I've been oppressed for many years for not starving myself. And uh, I, I think it's wrong to change the rules for a living once people are growing up alone, homeless and poor. Yeah. Um, do you think the United States is the best country in the world? Um, I think that um, emphasizing uh, the fact that people are made whole and holy matrimony is important. Yeah. And America is called America because marriage is important. And, you know, Mary is the mother of Jesus. And we, we call ourselves married when, we're, when we get married. 
and we're made whole and complete in holy matrimony and that's a rite of passage too part of growing up and um, so in that sense in that sense i think it's it's a, a great uh, part of america to to emphasize marriage like yeah. the back of the two dollar bill uh -huh. depicts the sign of declaration of independence and it's yeah. there's just two people in marriage uh -huh. okay yeah it's a two dollar bill mm -hmm. yeah um, do you consider yourself Democrat or Republican, or neither? Uh, um, probably Democrat. Uh, what do you think of Donald Trump? Is he doing a good job, or not really? Um, I, I just hope that uh, his marriage is real, and his yeah. wife is the same person every day. Yeah. That he's really married. Yeah. Uh, because the Constitution requires the president to be married. Yeah. And he has to be born in the United States and at least 45 years of age. Um, yeah, so those things are important. Yeah. I, I I get a good impression from what I see, you know. Yeah, that's cool.